there will be a day when I look in the mirror and I'm shredded, absolutely jacked. But that day's not today, apparently. Dang, my arms look so small. Nah, it's whatever. It is pouring outside, so I figured I'd come in here and do a workout. So I'm gonna record a workout real quick. I'll probably post that. And then, uh, I don't know, other than that, we're just gonna be hanging out. Probably get some food and uh, I don't know, I'll keep you updated later. It is absolutely pouring outside. So we're coming in here, we're gonna do a quick workout. I'll probably just do like full body. They don't really have a whole lot of stuff for legs. I might do something, but like legs, who needs that? Uh, I figured I'd just do some biceps to start off. We'll figure out where it takes us. This gym's pretty cool. They got a, a cable machine. I'll show you all that in a little bit. But they have a, enough to do everything for upper body pretty easily. So we're going to get started. All right. Figured I'd start off with some nice little hammer curls. I love starting with hammer curls. I don't know what it is about these, but they're just, they got to be my favorite. Either this, bench press. I honestly probably just this or bench press and it's probably just because I can lift really heavy with it but you know gotta boost that ego a little bit all right it's a good little warm-up but I already know being on this trip and eating the food that we're eating my love handles Boy, they're gonna get they're gonna get pretty swole. Probably a lot more swole than my muscles are, but we're still doing pretty good. Uh, I feel like we're chilling. I have nothing to worry about. When we get back, I'll get back on the good diet, good workout routine. It'll be sweet. All right, we're moving up to the 30s now, and I used to not even be able to do this because I had wrist pain, and now I pretty much have zero wrist pain. So. We're doing good. And I'm so happy that I didn't end up like doing MRIs on my shoulder and stuff. Cause if you didn't know, the reason I completely stopped working out is because I either aggravated a tear I already had or got like another little tear or something. But the dude was trying to get me to get surgery. And I was like, I ain't doing all that. So I didn't even end up going to get the MRI because the MRI itself was like 1500 bucks. And, uh, yeah, I just, I ain't doing that. So I didn't do that. Now my shoulder's fine. I feel good. We're going to work out. I'm so glad to be back. And I'm not going to go like 100% still. I'm going to be cautious because I feel like it's better to do little growth and grow slowly than it is to bounce back and forth because it's just demotivating having to take a long time off. Oh, okay. I'm gonna add more weight. I figured I'll do one more set of the lighter weight with the hammer curls. Uh, not really lighter weight. I'm gonna go up and wait. I'll do one more set with hammer curls, and I'm gonna go use that machine right there, and I'll do some triceps. Because I kind of want to do a full body because I haven't been working out the past couple of days. Um, I could have worked out yesterday, but we've been driving in the car so much that it's just like, I don't know. I don't think it's it's worth making myself that exhausted and sore. Um, but if I do a full body now, now that we're here, I'll make up for those days I missed. And then, you know, we'll be, we'll be catching up. But as always, we're feeling good. Wind off with the 45s. A little bit more swing in action. But heck yeah. And with these, I know I'm swinging like crazy, but the goal is to get it up 
and then try your best to hold it up not to go up slow and go down slow i mean you can do it that way too but you're definitely not going to be doing it in the 40s all right i figure we do three sets of the curls we'll do three sets of triceps we're just going to do the bar and i'll just do some normal tricep extension like this uh and that'll probably be the extent of the triceps but we'll see We're doing so-called 90 pounds now, but the rack is weird. Like the, there's no way the weight's right. I don't know what it means. I don't know what it means to be lifting 70 pounds on this. I mean, the stack goes all the way down to 200, but there's no way. But sorry, right, we'll do, we'll do this for a few. more of these with this weight and then I'll start working on a little bit of chest. I don't really know what I'm gonna do for back. I might just do some like bent over rows or something but either way we're gonna go work out. Alright we're doing one more quick set. Call it good. Really good there. And I realize there's a there's a pull up thing on this, so that's how I'll do back. Alright. And as per usual, they only have 50 pound dumbbells. So we're gonna be doing bench with that, but that should be per that should that should be plenty. Just go to failure for a few sets and then or maybe just near failure. I'm not too worried about trying to gain a ton of strength there. The main goal is just maintain. That first set cut off because I ran out of storage. But we're gonna do two more sets of this. And one thing I kind of forgot about was the fact that I lost a lot of strength. Um, from not working out for like a month. So 50s are actually hard. Uh, but I mean, I can still get like 12. Um, I'll do this for two more sets and I think I'm gonna call it a day today because I got food coming to the room. I gotta eat, so I should be good. set and we're calling it good.
Alright. I'm gonna do the pose room check back at the room. So see y'all up there. Let me do the physique check in the Second elevator. Floor. Oh my gosh. I got my cheeseburger and french fries. Heck yeah. Well, let's do the pose room check. Heck yeah. I feel like I'm looking better, but like, still got work to do. Gotta get rid of this and this. We're feeling good. I say that as I'm about to eat a cheeseburger, but it's okay. We're doing good. This will be gone at some point. Heck yeah.